Joshua Crew here. Welcome to the Joshua Crew Show. Today is Tuesday, Tuesday, January the twenty third, two thousand twenty four. Yes, it has, folks. And you heard about the walk, right? You heard about going to WrestleMania to face War Marines, right? That's potentially and hopefully, and we'll see what happens. The World Rumble is just about five days, about four days away. It's the pay per view that starts Saturday night with four matches. <clears throat> it's going to be the match. Roman Reigns will face not one, not two, but three opponents Randy Orton, LA Knight, and AJ Styles. On the other hand, you're going to see Kevin Owens facing Logan Paul for the United States Championship. And then you had the Dirty Man Wild Wobble Match and the Dirty Woman Wild Wobble Match that will be starting, <coughs> well, that Saturday. They will have four matches, maybe about, f- including we're going to have one. But <coughs> all I can see is, wow. Now, this is, you always know reason what The Rock is going to do. This morning, The Rock has told, The Rock has told by the rumors that, that he's not, he's going to face Roman Reigns for the, at the WWE really do of us watching, you know, <coughs> they haven't faced each other. They haven't faced each other since. And there's a chance that will happen. It might happen. I really don't know. But it's potentially, it's 100% confirmed. We all know that. Now, doing now the first take on ESPN. Now, doing an appearance on ESPN's first take on Tuesday, WWE legend The Rock discussed the possibility of facing his cousin, Wami Reigns, at WrestleMania. When asked if a match against Reigns could be in his future, The Rock responded, There's a chance. The Rock went on to call himself a long gamer and say, I like to build, before express his belief that a WrestleMania main event between himself and Reigns could make for the greatest and the biggest WrestleMania of all time. So there's a chance, there's a chance right now. And what happened? So now, here's what The Rock said. Now, traditionally, The Rock talked about his desire to grow and build WWE and say he wants the world to watch if he and Reigns face each other. The Rock and Reigns have both expressed public interest in having a match together at versus points. And fans had long speculated about it happening. Back in September, The Rock appeared on a Pat McAfee show and said he had a handshake deal in place for the match against Reigns at WrestleMania 39 last year, but it didn't end up happening since the parties involved couldn't decide where it would lead to. Now, as we go again now, in the that same interview, the Rock said he remained open to doing the match at some point if the stars were to align. Early this month, The Rock made a surprise appearance on Raw, and he got the wrestling world buzzing when he turned the hair of the table, which is one of the ring's nicknames. Before the appearances on first take on Tuesday, WWE announced Tuesday morning in a press release that The Rock had been adding to board of directors for TKO Group Holdings, which is the name of the company both from the WWE UFC major. That suggests The Rock will be more heavily involved with WWE moving forward and it could make a match against Reigns more likely. WrestleMania 40 in is in fair definitely in April, but WWE has seemingly been building towards a rematch between Reigns and Cody Rhodes for the undisputed WWE Universal Championship at that show. 
Rock the Rock versus Reigns at WrestleMania 40 is possible. The Rock comments about waiting to build towards something big and play the long game. May suggest, may suggest he is aiming for the Reigns at Rock match at a WrestleMania footer down the line. <coughs> and as you all know, Fox Sports, Sports, you all know about this match. It's going to be awesome. And it will be awesome, a dream match between their two cousins, The Rock and Roman Reigns. That will be Saturday and Sunday, April the 6th and 7th. And you know what's going on, what has happened down there. They never had a match, well, they're supposed to be having a match at WrestleMania 39. Fox. If that's true, then it will happen at WrestleMania 40. Now, we all just said about this. Well, anyway, The Rock has not wrestled since 2016 when he faced Eric Warman and he won the match. So, in the meanwhile, it's going to be a good match. And for whatever, for whatever reason, we're going to see what's happening, what will happen here. That will be a couple of months. Will be happening in a couple of months. You know, the WWE 2K24 for PS4 and PS5 is coming on March the 8th. That will be Friday, March the 8th. But let's not, but, but let's cut to the chase. Let's not, let's talk about, let's talk about Cody Rose was a cover. Cody Rose is a cover of WWE 2K24. Congratulations to him. Set once has been injured and has been sustained the injury. And something did happen when he faced Jen Mahal that was on last Monday, last Monday, that was on the 15th of January. <coughs> he did, he did win the match, but he did sustain an injury. And I really don't know if he might wrestle or not, but he's keeping his tower, WWE. War Harry Tower. I think he will hit in there. He's gonna be rehabbing, and then when he comes back, when he gets there, I think he tells us his knee and mine. It was a minor injury. So <clears throat> three to four months. I don't. I really don't know. I really don't know what's going to happen here. But what I just said, what I just say is. Seth Rollins believes that he's going to be okay. And I'm really worried about Seth Rollins. It will be, it could be, it's supposed to be Seth Rollins and Cena Punk. We'll see what happens. So it could be, it's supposed to be on Cena Punk and, and Seth Rollins at WrestleMania 40. Now the place we have built, now will we see this and this see that? We don't know. I really don't know what's going to happen. It is what it is. And that fest gets raw. Now, we all know that the raw, the mighty, WWE Mighty Night Raw will continue. It has been building. Mighty Night Raw has been building since 1993. So, it is what it is, ladies and gentlemen. The breaking news as of right now, Netflix, Netflix gets WWE Raw. So it might happen here, folks. I just said, what I just said about this, well, anyway, it is happening. It's happening, folks. The breaking news of this one. Now, <coughs> here's a look at this. The whole point of Netflix, when it starts streaming, was to be different from traditional television. The company created the full season bringing in a mobile with paid subscriptions that sort of limits ads. Now, the point of Netflix is to replace traditional television. And that means in some cases becoming traditional television as such. The still has traveled on internet tales and live streams and now it's assuming the matter of the one of broadcast TV's time 
Honest Dampos, WWE's Monday Night Raw, all going to answers. That fest has struck a momentum and 10 year deal to add Monday Night Raw starting in 2025. The deal is Vanna at a whooping $500 million and marks the first time that the WWE flagship series will move off of broadcast television in its 30 year history outside of the US. That first will attack the rest of the WWE family too, including SmackDown, WrestleMania, SummerSlam, Royal Rumble. Inside the US, SmackDown is moving to the USN Network and NXT is moving to the CW Network. Keep up. He said, We are excited to have WWE War with its who is in positive and medical television and fan bases on Netflix. Said Netflix, see content episode Bella Bergera by combining an all rich. Recommendations are friendly with WWE. Will it be able to deliver more joy and value for the diners and raw members? Why is the best of sports entertainment blending in great characters and storyteller with line action 52 weeks a year? And will agree to be in this long term partnership with WWE? This isn't even the WWE's only big news of the day, per deadline. The franchise, the franchise's biggest success story. Dwayne Dwight Johnson has joined the ball of directors of THKL Group Holdings, Incorporated, the company forming in a manager last year between WWE and UFC, fought gladly by innovators. In addition to getting a piece of the pie, the piece of the pie and a seat at the table. Johnson gained an ownership of the trademark for the name The Rock, which he picked up during his WWE days. So now we all just says no, it's not gonna it's not gonna be in the WWE War is not gonna be inside the United States anymore. It will be outside the United States. Netflix is <coughs> War is going home and it's coming home. On Netflix, that will be starting on January the 25th. 20, I mean, no, 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 no. January 2025. January 2025. It's about a little, about a year away. And I got let me show you, folks, so I cannot, what is happening here, folks. We got WWE War on Netflix will be starting in 2025. That's going to be in January, just one year away. And you got. The whole steps that going to happen, but I can I can ensure this, folks, ladies and gentlemen. I can ensure this. This is this whole stuff is real. The Rock could it be the Rock versus War Marines at WrestleMania 40? I don't know. Could it be something like this can happen? But all I can say is, wow, this is how this is gonna gonna be. This is where it's gonna be. This is going going to do it. It's going to discover. <coughs> I can't I can't say that about this enough. But it's coming, and I can I can assure you about that that this is how it's all about for real, for sure. I am um, this this is how it's going to be. The WWE grows bigger. It can it's going to continue to grow. It will continue to grow, years and years and years. That's 10 years, and that's 20 years. It does not matter for, to me. Anyway. So, anyway, Joseph Kurt here, and I'm about to sign off. I hope you had a nice time. Uh, and I know there's going to be warm weather here for tomorrow, Thursday and Friday, where it's going to be rainy anyway. Uh, we'll be doing a uh, sock gravel basketball versus cardboard start. And we'll be showing. In the couple of days. Okay, it's time for us to go. Joseph Kruder, please subscribe this video on the Joseph Kruder Network 2. And I will be seeing you next time. Tune in. Take care, everybody. Peace out. Bye.